is unbelievable. Okay, so it has to do with one of my favorite movies of all time, second to David Bowie in The Labyrinth, probably, but I'm not sure. It has to do with The Wizard of Oz. Oh. Here's what happened. Okay, so okay. the um, Catholic University of America, which is in Washington, D.C., in 1972, an actress by the name of Mercedes McCollum gave the dress that Judy Garland wore in The Wizard of Oz to the university. Now, allegedly, because they could never quite find it after the actress gifted it okay. to the university. So it was this myth, it was a legend, they couldn't find it. Enter Matt Rippa. Matt Rippa, Matt Rippa was um, the occupation, the occupation, the, um, what is it? The um, um, uh, um, operations, yes. operations manager yes. at the university. I'm like, um, um, sounds so like. <laughs> he started looking throughout the theater, he started trying to find it, couldn't find it, so he thought, you know what, it is a legend, it's a myth, we're not gonna find it. Lo and behold, the last year they started doing renovations. Stop he it. found a garbage bag. Within the garbage <gasps> bag was a shoebox. Within that shoebox <laughs> was the dress that Judy Garland did indeed wear. Oh, what you're looking at right now God. is the authentication that took place at the Smithsonian. It has her name inscribed in it with a secret pocket. You can see there, and now it will be preserved forever in the museum so you can go there and look at it yourself. That, it, that deserves a round of applause. I mean, can you believe that? That Whoa. is incredible. I mean, speak Look to at us. it. It's Look beautiful. at that. Can you believe it? I can't believe it. It is not a myth. The real and deal. not in Kansas anymore. I All like right, we got to get to this last one really quick because yes, we're helping people with it. Um, okay. Hosea Helps, we love to highlight them here on the yes. show. You've done it many, many times. The Back to School Jamboree Ooh. happens every year. Hosea Helps, Inc. does two summer programs to support families in need. No Summer Hunger, a feeding program for children from June through July, and the Back to School Jamboree. So the Back to School Jamboree was started 16 years ago to provide underserved children with the necessary resources and supplies to be successful in school school this yeah. year's event it's happening tomorrow Yay. it's sponsored by Foot Locker Atlanta Microsoft and the Georgia International Convention Center and will be a drive-through event easy good the event will provide more than 1,000 children <gasps> with free book bags filled with school supplies shoes from Foot Locker Atlanta grocery boxes and other necessities to help How them awesome. thrive in school yes so great this event is free and open to the public so for more information or to donate we still need school supplies oh, Visit gonna say forhosea.org forhosea.org mm -hmm. and we talked about it in the last few weeks like the excitement of having your school year start off on the right foot I mean it's so important to give these kids yeah. that confidence that they need mm -hmm. especially given the last year and a half so yes. thank you Kara yes, thank you thank Love you it. Right, I'm not okay going anywhere. if you, that's right <laughs> she's coming up next if you have a fun or interesting it's all good story please send it to us it's facebook.com slash atl and co or tweet us using that hashtag it's, it's all good, good.